about two dozen Democratic senators have come forward with statements denouncing Franken's alleged behavior during a USO tour in December 2006. Anchorwoman and sportscaster Leanne Tweeden said Thursday that Franken groped and kissed her without her consent. Most of the senators called for an ethics investigation, and many acknowledged that workplace sexual harassment has long been ignored. Senators Kirsten Gillibrand, DNY, and John Tester, DeMont, have vowed to take campaign money they received from Franken's PAC and donate it to charity. For more news videos visit News Pulse View. Sexual harassment and misconduct should not be allowed by anyone, and it should not occur anywhere, Senator Kamala Harris, D. California, said. This story is extremely troubling and the behavior is unacceptable. I will support an investigation by the Senate Ethics Committee. Their swift, straightforward responses are a far cry from the statements that Republican senators trickled out after four women accused more of sexually harassing them when they were between the ages of 14 and 18. Many of the senators hedged their calls for more to suspend his campaign by using some version of the phrase, if these allegations are true. Senator John McCain, R. Arizona, was one of the few senators to unequivocally say more was unfit for office. Below are more statements from Democratic senators regarding the Franken allegations. From Senator Tammy Duckworth, Deal, from Senator Maria Cantwell, D. Wash, from a spokesman for Senator Michael Bennett, D. Colo, from Senator Dianne Feinstein, D. California, many others shared their comments on social media, Rep. Keith Ellison, D. Min, also called for people to take Tweeden's accusations seriously. I'm deeply disturbed by what I read today, he said. It took extraordinary bravery for Leanne Tweeden to come forward. Al Franken has been a good friend of mine for years, but we as a progressive community must take her words seriously and fully commit ourselves to creating a world free from sexual harassment and assault. This article has been updated with additional responses from Democratic senators.